Hello, this is Play and Speaking, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Blackwell Legacy, part two or three. Part. Well, that depends on how I choose to edit these videos, but uh, let's go. We have a girl in uh, in the asylum that we have to uh, visit this time to sort out. There's a ghost. Do you coming? Yeah, sure. Problem. So here we go. So, I think it's it, it was the Asian girl who was in the uh, at the asylum or the Bellevue Psychiatric Hospital. If we have to be the man, I hate this place. I was stuck here for twenty five years. Why'd you have to drag me back here, huh? Yeah. Well, sorry. Jo Shh. <laughs> if you want to start a rock, keep your. Okay, let's try to... Okay, who was it again that we have to wear? Uh... Was it Ellie? No, it's not Ellie. It's Kelly? No, it's not Kelly. Susan! It was Susan, right? Okay, let's talk to this guard, shall we? Okay, it's Susan Lee, that's it. Is Susan Lee a patient here? Susan? Yeah, we've got her. She came in about a week ago. May I visit Susan Lee? Sure. If you're on the approved guest list. Hmm. Uh, what was your name again? Obstacle. Rosangela Blackwell. Sorry, you're not on the list. She'll be out in a week. You can visit her then. Okay, let's just see Dr. Quentin just... Oh, shit, I'm goals. here to see Dr. Quentin. Sure thing, you're clear. Go right in. And in we go. Come in. Dr. Quentin? Oh, hello. Come in, come in. Let's see, let's ask about Joey. Did my aunt and grandmother ever say anything specific about Joey? No. Why? Have you learned anything? Oh, no, I... I was just wondering. Oh, real subtle. <laughs> Dr. Quentin, I've got something to tell you. Hmm? Yes? It's about Joey. Oh? Oh, no. <laughs> Don't you dare. Yeah. Darling, you seem like a sweet kid. Don't ruin everything this early in the game. I, um... This early in the game? Hey! Was whatever you think you're doing, stop right now. You say one word to this quack about me and the jig is up. He... Are you listening? I just spent 25 years in this dump. I'm not gassed up to do it again, you dig? You want to be locked up in a padded cell with me for company? Because that's what'll happen. And I'll highly, make sure highly your life that. is a living hell. Um... Think about it. Yes, Miss Blackwell? Never mind. Good girl. Keep your yap shut, and we'll get on just fine. Okay, I highly doubt that if she told Dr. Quentin that uh, she could see Joey and Joey's a ghost, I highly doubt that she, under any circumstances, would end up in a padded cell. she would probably just be evaluated, and then, I mean, she would still be fit to, li to live normally, only that she, she was able to see Joey, and she would be on some medication, and she, I mean, I highly doubt she, she would be in a petted cell. I guess I'll head out. Very well. Goodbye. I, I mean, if she did end up in a petted cell just because of that, it, then it would be a pretty corrupt psych psychiatric hospital, <laughs> in my opinion. Okay, let's see. We can go through here because it's locked, so we have locked. to... Locked. Whatever's back there, I can't get to it. You need a key to open it. Hmm. We need a key, so we need... Okay, so we have to get to Ellie... No, not Ellie. Susan Lee, somehow. And then we... To do that, we have to lure this guy away from his desk. Somehow. I don't think so. I don't think I need any of these keys. Yes, you do. 
Okay, just talk to the Guardian. I'd like to see Susan Lee, please. I told you. You know. Oh, well, that's because. Mm. Blame you. Blame the I system. I wasn't on the list at the time. I should be on it now. <laughs> oh, really? Well, let's check then. What was your name again? Okay. Okay, we have to give some name. Um, not Kelly. Maybe Adrian? My name is Adrian. Sorry, no Adrian's on the guest list. Hmm. Whoops. I'd like to see. S I told. Oh, that. I was. I should be on. Let's try oh, really? this again well, with a different let's check. name. What was your? <laughs> I like how he just kind of forgets. Let's see. Susan. No, oh, Ellie. Ellie, the dead girl. My name is Allie. Right. Well, you're still not on the list. I don't think they'd let dead people on the list, sweetheart. Yeah. Good try. <laughs> I'd like. I told. Oh, well, that. Blame your memory. I gave you the wrong name. You did what? Yeah, gave the wrong name. Sorry, it's a character in a play I'm in. <laughs> okay. Ugh. Character. That's the best you could come up with? Yeah. Really? I feel you, bro. Well, what is your name? Hmm. My name is Davenport. Davenport? That's it? Um... Rosa Davenport? Sorry, you're still not on the list. <laughs> Rosa Davenport has a pretty nice ring to it, actually. I'd like to see Susan Lee, please. I told you. Oh, that... Okay, let's blame the guard. You didn't see it? Maybe you should check again. I missed it, huh? I'm sure of it. <laughs> this is going well, nowhere. let's check again. What was your name again? He just keeps forgetting, doesn't he? This is amazing game logic. What's your name again? You told me five different names, but let's try one more time. My name is Joanne. Sorry, there are no jo I don't think they'd let dead people- But good try. Thanks. Uh-huh. Okay. We need to do something else. We need some kind of name that would allow allow us in. Somehow. We need to find someone who would be admitted in. Maybe a parent or something. Do research. Let's see. Susan. I already looked her up. Susan Lee is at Bellevue. Mm. That's too... Whoever the D... Davenport is too common in... Okay, so we need more information, and where do we get more information? Let's try the dorms again, and see what happens. Okay, let's try Adrian, see if he hmm? knows something. Hi, it's- You have more questions, I imagine? Yeah, hmm. is that okay? I suppose so. What I do you want to know? I suppose so. Did you ever meet Joanne's friend, Susan? The name doesn't ring a bell, I'm afraid. Hmm. Do you know anything about Ouija boards? I'm afraid not. Yeah, okay. I don't, I don't think well, we'll that's all. Thanks for helping. Just remember, just... leave my name out of it. Let's leave, shall we? Oh, let's do this. Yeah, open. After you. Yeah. Could I ask you some follow up questions, Kelly? <sighs> Fine. Make it quick. I like how Kelly just lists anyone in. Do you know if Joanne had any interest in Ouija boards? No. <laughs> Does the name Deacon help? Nope. I'm agnostic. <laughs> okay. I don't suppose you know anything about Susan? Not much. Quiet, I guess. Maybe she just didn't talk around me. I never stuck around long enough to get to know her. Hmm. Do you know anything about Joanne's friend Allie? You mean Miss Blondie? Yeah. I know enough, which isn't much. She was over here all the time visiting Joanne. She was kinda sweet, I guess. Laughed all the time. Ugh, oh, that was annoying. That was usually my cue to get out of here. What do you want to know about her? I'm having difficulty finding her. Would you know where she is? I don't know, she could be anywhere. Studying, partying. Pushing up daisies. Shh. Huh? Nothing. <laughs> right. 
can you tell me a little why? Just background. Oh, think suit yourself. So what? To be honest, that she was studying. She was so vanilla. You know, just she. Did you? Um, all the would it? No, why? She's just. just I think. So you won't killed herself? No. No. Are we? Thanks for helping. Yeah, sure. Please let me look. It would really. Help. I've helped you out enough. You can ask your stupid questions, but you touch nothing. Thanks again. Whatever. Can I? No. Joanne and I, but I'll be damned. There was some way where I could uh, play as Joey, but I'm not. I can't remember how. Hmm. I recognize her. That's her. She looks so happy. I wonder what happened to make her like that. The future Mrs. Davenport? I wonder what that means. Maybe there's a connection, but I can't see it. The girls were interested in Ouija boards, and they are all haunted by someone named the Deacon. Hmm. Could there be a connection? Perhaps. Deacon and Ouija. Hmm. Okay, we could. Okay, we could talk about go Ghost Girl about being haunted. Potentially, let's try that. Oh yeah, way to turn over every stone looking for clues. Oh, come on. What do you want from me? I'm doing the best I can. Well, try a bit harder. Thank you for the motivational speech there, Joey. It's really helpful. Okay, let's try the Washington Square Park and see if uh, our girl over here has a response. Let's talk to that ghost again, Joey. Yeah, sure. Hey there. Remember me? No. Maybe. Deacon and Ouija. Did you summon something with a Ouija board? Did I? That's why I'm asking you. <laughs> Did I? Hate I hate those things. things. I'll never I'll use, use one, one again. again. And why is that? Because... The Deacon, kid. Did you get in contact with someone called the Deacon? The Deacon! deacon. I hate him so much. I knew it. Hmm. <laughs> damn kids and your damn Ouija boards. We got somewhere. Woo. Don't worry, we'll clean up this mess. Can you tell me anything else about Susan? Little Lady Lee. I won't say much. Hmm. Do you know anyone named Davenport? No. Maybe. Really helpful there. Tell me again about Joe. Beware of Joanne when her plans and. Can you won't say Can you tell me anything about yourself, Al? Ali Montego, a story and a song. She kisses the boys, but not for long. Right. Cause it, they, so they totally, totally summon someone with a Ouija board. And yeah, let's go back. Oh, just we'll figure <sighs> You alright? This is gonna take a long time to get used to. We got the rest of your life, doll. Nice. Can we even go over here? No, we cannot. Let's go back to the apartment and talk to Joey and see what we can do about this Ouija board. Let's see. There is obviously a connection between the Deacon and these girls, but what? That is a good question. There is obviously a connect- Okay, let's try Deacon and Ouija and Joanne suicide. There is obviously a connection between the Deacon and these girls, but what? Hmm. Okay. That makes no sense. Alright. Let's talk to Joey. If Joey stands still, please. Joey, come here a sec. Yes? Open notebook, Deacon, and Ouija board. Any idea who the Deacon might be? No idea. Although, he must be a pretty formidable fellow, considering what's been going on. Okay, that cleared up nothing. I don't suppose you know anything about Susan? Nope, no more than you. So the ghost's name is Allie. Looks like it. And she's trapped in the dog run at Washington Square Park. That's where she is. And we have to save her. Yep. Is this going to be a tip? You'll look back on... 
I wonder if the name Davenport has any significance. It could. You never know. Um, what do you think of Kelly? That kid? I suppose once you get past all that metal and the clothes. Not to. What do you think? Adrian. <laughs> His parents must have really hated him to saddle him with that name. Joey. Still, to be sharing a floor with a bevy of young college ladies. Huh. Maybe he doesn't have it so bad. Why would Joanne commit suicide? Who knows? Maybe she was in a hurry. <laughs> My God. That's not funny. You want a different answer, ask a different ghost. I don't suppose you'd know anything about Joanne, would you? Nope, no more than you. Judging by the picture, she knows that sob story in the park. But that's all. I think I've heard enough. Yeah, let's get going. I don't need... I want to... Okay. Can what I is get it, dear? anything useful out of Joe here? Okay, ask about Joe ghostly powers. So what can you actually do? Do? As a ghost. Any powers or anything like that? What you see is what you get, dear. Mm -hmm. I can float through walls as long as I'm still near you. But you can't touch anything. Not really. Not really? Well, you remember that breeze you felt when I manifested myself last night? Yeah. That's the extent of my physical presence. <laughs> yes, that's what I'm talking trick, about. Huh? Not really. Everyone's a critic. How did you die? Excuse me? How did I die? <laughs> yeah. That's Rude. a bit of a personal question, isn't it? Is it? Yes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> well, that, it, but uh, his ghostly powers with the blowing things is actually going to be relevant. I remember it, it, it is going to be relevant. I just can't remember exactly where, but that is important. So let's talk some more to Joey and see what comes up. Can't you stay still? Huh? The way you float all over the room like that, you're making me dizzy. <laughs> you sound like my mother. You're just gonna have to get used to it, babe. <laughs> Can you ever leave? Leave? What do you mean, leave? Leave. Get out of my apartment. Go somewhere else. What, don't you like me? Well, it's not that. It's just, well, what about privacy? I'll turn my back when you're in the shower, don't worry. And what about personal space? I'm a ghost. It's not like I take up any <laughs> space. You know what I mean. Sorry, darling, no can do. I told you I can't travel far from my... hosts. I can go maybe 30 feet before something stops me. That must be annoying. Eh, it's not so bad now. After 25 feet. years watching your aunt drool, this is like staying at the Ritz. <laughs> so what can you do again? You want a repeat performance? All right. Well, Evil doers beware. I'm Joey Malone, and I command the power of light breezes. <laughs> well, Joey's ghostly powers really blows her. <laughs> <laughs> what else can we do to learn more about the ghost in the park? The photo, dear. It's the biggest clue we have. Remind me, how do we convince ghosts that they're- Like I said, like an- How do we help a ghost- With my- I give one- You- You don't come- No, that's you. What was Auntie Lauren like? What do you want to know about her for? I just do. Can't you tell me anything? Hey, we've got lots to do. Ask me later. <laughs> What was my grandmother like? Her? We have to talk about her? What's wrong with her? Nothing. Forget it. Ask me later. <laughs> I think I've heard- Yeah, let's get- But his coffee pals are going to be quite relevant. You coming? Yeah, sure. So that's something. Thank you.